plants because oxygen, right? Hi everyone, I'm Victoria and it's been a really long time since I filmed and edited or what? Well, not really a long time, it's just been one week or less than two weeks, but still kind of a long time for me. You know those kinds of students you see in the movies, like you have the jocks, the popular kids, the emos, the nerds, etc. Um, well, in the real world, it's not really like that, although there are stereotypes, it's not that kind of kinds or types of students. At least not in the Philippines, but, or, at least not in my school. But anyway, um, this week's video is the kind of students you see in school, in the real world, not in the movies. So, video proper. That was so nerdy. First type is the GC. GC as in grade conscious, but you know, let's get real people. It's just a sugar-coated name for nerd. The GC people are those that study harder than anyone else. They study while they're eating, while they're asleep, while they're waking up, while they're toothing brushing, or while they're soaping their bodies. They also always raise their hand in class. And of course, they get on the top 10 list. Somebody just passed by, so. Next is the Pethics. Um, it is kind of a lingo in the Filipino language. No, Pethics. But, Pethics. Those are the easygoing, chill students in class that are totally opposite from the GCs in terms of studying habits. Seriously, they do not study as much as the GC people. They probably just study 1% of 100. Now the next one is still Pethics. Easygoing, chill, they do not study as hard as the GCs, but get this. They get good grades. Yes, they do. They get good grades. Why? I will tell you why. They are those who are smart enough to not actually study as hard, but still get good grades. You know, they might even get in the top 10 list. Nobody ever said the world was fair. There are actually also those kinds of people who are chill and easygoing for a long time, and in the end, when the deadline is there, when you have an exam the next day, they cram. They cram and everything still gets into their head and they still get good grades. Well, it isn't fair. Because other people, they need to study as hard as hell to get good grades. The next category is the ghost. Well, not really. The disappearing student. students who do not go to class a lot because I don't know I don't have the time to ask them because they're absent I don't know why I'm waking a lot today but the next category is the sleeping beauty yes there are times when the professor is so boring and the lecturer is so boring and half of the class is asleep that's an exception but these sleeping beauties, they sleep any time of the day in the class. It's like they're making the classroom their bedroom. It's like they do not sleep anywhere else but the classroom. The next one is the rich kid. I don't know, probably because I do not study in a private school, but um, in our school, the rich kids are kind of a big deal. Anyway, self-explanatory, they are the kids who are rich. Need I say more? Number seven is the amnesia. Well, you know, amnesia is caused because of a concussion in your head, but these people, I don't know what they're doing with their lives, but they forget a lot of things. Might be old age, I don't know, but these are the people who forgot, forgot to bring this and forgot to do that. So, you know, they usually say, oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to do my homework. Can I copy yours? Or 
or oh I forgot to bring paper can I have some of yours? the light the sun is eating my face Okay, the next one, we have the class clowns. They are those who are the funny ones in the class. They are those who make the whole class laugh or make fun of the professor behind their back. Bad before my school are probably those who do bad vices like, you know, smoke a lot, drink a lot, swear, swear a lot, so swear a lot, what? But yeah. Next category is Korean students. What? To be honest, there are a lot of Korean students in the Philippines and in our school, we also have Korean students, so what's your problem? The last type of student we have is the wallflower. They are those who are quiet and, you know, just in the corner, quiet. Um, they're like those who are always absent, but they're actually there. They're like ghosts. I think I've had my hand like this since like forever. Okay everyone, that was it for today's video. I hope you liked it. Please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. Yeah. So, um, yeah. If you haven't seen last week's video, it is here. Just click on the space here. I don't even know if I know how to make the annotation thing, but yeah. Just click here if I do know. I love you guys. See you next week. Bye! I don't even know. I don't even know if I know how to do it. Hey, what up? I don't even know. If... Um, okay, that's it for today. Today, I just gotta make them ready. The sun is eating my face. Oh. Can you not watch TV? I'm making a video. Jackie can't stand not watching the buzz because she wants to get on with the gossip. I mean, I don't know, at least not in the film. Plants, because oxygen, right?